<laughs> Hello there, and today we are gonna animate some colors with texture paint. So we have a character here, and, a, and it is animated with some scared facial expression. So now what we are gonna do is gonna click on this character and go to the UV editing tab. Now press A to select all of the geometry. First you need to be in edit mode and then press U for smart UV project and press OK. This must do the job. Now we have projected UV map which we can use for texture painting. Now we are gonna go in the texture paint slot and gonna add a new texture. I'm gonna call it scared. And change the color to something light blue or maybe blue. It depends. Now we will go to the shading tab here and gonna add a mix RGB node. So now we have a factor value here. If we turn this factor value to the left side, we have the color of our texture paint but if we turn it to the right side then we have this color but we want our base color to be here so what i'm gonna do now is unplug this first and gonna hover my mouse here gonna press ctrl and c to copy the color and gonna paste it by ctrl plus v right over here and now i'm gonna again plug this back to the base color and now if we turn the factor to the right side we have our principal normal bsdf color which we wanted and on the left side our texture paint slot so first i'm gonna turn this to the left side and then gonna go in the texture paint mode and now i'm gonna paint some textures on it That will work for me. So let us animate now. I have created a little timeline tab here. To create it, all you need to do is slide this uh, slide from your drag and pull it up this. And then go to here, edit the type, and then select timeline. Yeah, you have a timeline now. So, first, I want the color to be normal. And let us see where the expressions, where the facial expressions start animating from. So it animates from here, okay. At 224 then I need a keyframe here. Right click, insert a keyframe. Here you can see the keyframe of our node here. However to view the keyframe, it is necessary to select the node first. I'm gonna jump to frame 234 maybe and then increase I mean and then decrease the factor all the way to the down so we have this color here now we have our keyframe at 234 let this view of our animation now it gets scared and the color changes it looks so awesome but this is not just it the texture will not automatically get saved and so on to save the texture First, you have to go to the UV editing tab and select your texture. We named it scared. Here we go. Here we have it, the texture. And then I'm gonna click to the image and then save as save as image. And then you can save your image every time whenever you change your texture. Now it's done. You can render it now. It will look good. So thank you guys for watching this video, hope you have learned something new today, see ya!